All right, so I got another gazillion packages, actually four in the mail. This is for my birthday this time. It's uh, got another bazillion eBay cards. So uh, my, my birthday comes right after Christmas. Luckily, it doesn't land on Christmas. But uh, so this is a lot of stuff I got with eBay cards. I think I'm quite sure I have more coming, but this is the stuff. So we'll start with the first package. And la, 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 la. Did I cut? Yes, I did cut a piece of... All right, I think it's an invoice. I hope it's just an invoice. Yeah, whatever. Okay, so this is for my PS2. It's PS2 component cables. I have component cables that work with PS2, PS3, and, and Xbox. You know, it's like universal, you know, blah, 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 a universal cable, but I don't like to have to switch them out all the time, so I got a pair, uh, a set of uh, PS2 component cables. Plus, I think there was some kind of issue with... Uh, Oh yeah, I wanted to see if I could fix an issue with some of the PS2 uh, stuff. I think it just has to do with my HD PVR, but I would like to have an extra set so that I don't have to switch everything out every two seconds. So here's another package. I'll probably... Is there... No, I don't think I'm cutting something. Alright. Here we go. It is a copy of Super Mario and Duck Hunt for the NES. I wanted this because I wanted to... Uh, make some space for uh, some other carts. I had only Duck Hunt and I wanted both so I figured I'd have it both on one cart and that saves space and I'll probably get rid of the copy of Duck Hunt somehow. Okay so whatever this is. I think this is another NES game. La 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 la. And it is. This is one that I really was really looking forward to having. I have this on my 3DS, the 3D version. And that's Excite Bike. Eat Excite Bike. So I'll get these all cleaned up and you know have those to play. So now I have this one package and I'm quite sure I think I know what this is, but I won't say it. Uh, why not open it up on camera? It wouldn't hurt. Uh, arr, open this shit now or die. Okay, there we go. And this is a HDMI to component converter, which I actually got for that Wii uh, <clears throat> to HDMI uh, upscaler that I got. But I can't really use it with that because it doesn't support anything below 1080p and I can only record up to 1080i with my PVR. But I have another idea that, of something I could use this for. And if um, I'm actually planning on getting another one of those um, converters for the Wii, so I could probably end up getting one that supports 1080i or at least 720p. And this way I could actually capture it. But for now, I think I have an idea of something I can do with this. And this comes with an HDMI cable. I don't really think this isn't really that long. I don't know if this will be useful. But. Um, so, I'm going to open this thing up, and hopefully I can... You know, I was thinking about using this for the PS3 and Xbox 360, so that maybe using uh, HDMI uh, coming from the console would actually make things look better, even though it's going to still be component. Um, if I can open this, that would be great. Where do you open it? Oh. Is that it? Oh. Goes like that, and then open... And then we get this little tiny box, which is a good thing. I like little things so that they're not all over the place. And uh, it's got power. And it's got the little box here, which uh, it doesn't come with a component cable, but I, I think I could produce a component cable somehow. So yeah, that, that's, that's that. It's quite a simple box. It's not... Uh, there's no different uh, upscaling or downscaling or anything like that. It's just a box <laughs> that converts HDMI to component. So I'm going to check this out and see how that works. Uh, hopefully I can actually even get better quality from my uh, 360 and PS3 recordings through this. Kind of like, you know, I have um, something that converts a, uh, S video to AV signals. And, um, what's it called? When I plug in 
S video and it converts it to an AV signal. So sometimes it's necessary because the signal doesn't look good through S video, but when it's converted over to AV, it actually looks a lot better and it looks better than AV because it's normally sharper. Blah. I do that with my Saturn. If I, do, you know, if I plug in the S video and it, and uh, try to record it, it gets these weird vertical lines on the screen, which that goes away when I convert it to AV. But it also looks sharper than AV coming directly from this. To why am I showing that? He AV coming directly from the system. So that's about it. So that yeah, that's all my packages. Unless I'm missing something, then I'm coming back here to open it right now. But I think that's it. So. Thank you for watching. Have a great day.